Okay guys, uh, this month I acquired a handful more members to the collection. This one here came from Kelowna. I got this for free off Marketplace. It's a 1995 Gerber Mount Vernon. Only one similar to this I've seen on YouTube is the one Toilet Standard 53 owns. He's on that one for quite a while. I don't know if these were for export only. A little bit dirty because it sat out in an alleyway for the better part of three weeks. They had a bunch of miscellaneous free items. Uh, they, they had a nice queen size headboard. I, I wanted to get that as well for my bed, but by the time I got there, it was just this left. So, yeah, wanted a headboard and toilet, just got the toilet. <laughs> Better than nothing, that's for sure. I had a 1990 model uh, back in 2018, but unfortunately that one's long gone. I find these to be quite decent toilets for what they are. Not as good as the Radcliffe's, but uh, I like the way they're made. I, I like the later style of the tank here, the Aqua Saver type. Though I wouldn't mind getting the more traditional tank one. There's currently one for free on Marketplace near Kelowna as well, but uh, don't know if I have room for it. There's the date there, October 10th of 1995. It's got the original ball cock still. I've seen a few tanks with these plastic flappers, so I don't know if that's original or not. It seems to work quite well all the same. There's the logo. It doesn't it doesn't have consumption stamped on it, but it does have the CSA symbol. So uh, I believe that one, well these were made expressly for export to Canada at the time. Moving the tank here. You can see the spud. Very, very unique to these toilets. When I had my 1991, the gasket was blown, so I had to custom order one. But it was a worthwhile investment. Most of the time, uh, I, I figure this one might hold up. Because, uh, yeah, most of the time these gaskets are practically indestructible. Like the one I ordered, I still have it today somewhere. It sat out for a winter. Uh, still worked like a charm. Still even smelled new. Very nicely made gaskets. Guess I'll just show off the trapway again, because why not? Again, please excuse all the dirt. I, I haven't had the opportunity to clean this up. It's just been living in the back of my car. <laughs> yeah, all in all, it's a pretty decent model, and I can't wait to test flush it out a bit, see what it's got in store. Anyways, that's all for this video. I will see you guys in the next one.